Apple has recently updated and redesigned their free clips app to take advantage of the iPhone X, and also to bring new Star Wars themed special effects. With the app, you can do everything from sending a short video message to your friends to making a short film, complete with filters, stickers, emoji, posters, and customizable music. It can even turn your speech into animated captions. They've added a new feature for the iPhone X that places you into animated 360 degree scenes. So right here you can see scenes. Let's check this out. So here's selfie mode. Actually show you the rear camera view. If you guys can see this. 360 degree metropolis view right here. Let's check out riverfront, which I believe is the Golden Gate Bridge right there. Let's see, Millennium Falcon. Here's one of the Star Wars special effect features here. Let's go to the other camera. This is pretty legit. Let's go to the next one, the Mega Destroyer. It's complete with uh, background music too for all of these. Let's check out Sketchbook. Now this is a pretty cool effect. I don't know if you guys have ever seen the movie Scanner Darkly. It's got Keanu Reeves in it, but it's pretty awesome. It has like this kind of effect throughout the whole movie. Check out 8-bit. I mean, these are pretty cool effects. You can make some cool clips with this. Share it with friends. Tea Garden. That's pretty legit. Cityscape. This one's kind of got like a grayscale effect to your face, but it doesn't have music anymore. Galactic. Stickers, bunch of backgrounds. You could take photos, take videos with it. Graffiti, brush strokes. See these brush strokes and graffiti have this cool outline around your head too. My favorite of all time is the sketchbook. So let's select that one. So now we're at the main screen, and as you can see, we can take photos right here, or we can take videos by holding this button. As you can see, you gotta hold it. But first, let's add some effects. Let's first start out with some labels. There's some, there's location-based, Spokane, there's time-based, date-based. Let's do a look. Cool thing is you could actually change it. Customize the text, just like that. Moving around, let's do stickers. So here we got some Pixar, Disney, Star Wars. Let's take a look, what do we got here? These are new ones actually, the Star Wars one. A bunch of new animated stickers with Clips 2.0. They didn't have these before. A bunch of other animated ones. As you see, you have to download it. Let's add Luke Skywalker into here. Let's add Chewbacca. And of course, there's emoji as well. Look through those, you know, add whatever you want here. And now we can close that out. And now we can record. So you hold this button to record, but you actually slide up for continuous recording. And as you can see, I have the, uh, the speech to text right here for the captions, live titles, and it's all going off. But of course, it doesn't work that well all the time. So let's go ahead and stop the recording here. So another interesting thing is that you could actually add music. You can choose through your own music or go to soundtracks and just choose what Apple provides you. It's all royalty free and with Clips 2.0 they added a bunch of new songs too. So let's just choose one of these, Humble Pro. Downloading, tap on it, there you go. Apply it and the songs actually change depending on the duration of your clips automatically which is pretty cool. And the awesome thing with the iPhone 10 is it uses the true depth sensor to place you into the scene. It wouldn't be able to work otherwise. Let's record another clip. Slide up. And as you can see, the animated stickers are moving. Let's go ahead and stop. And you can also go into your library. You can import media and photos like that. And we also have posters. So we have a bunch of titles. They're all animated too. But now there's some new Star Wars ones and some Mickey and Friends ones. Let's choose this one right here. It's downloading. 
And now you just hold and record it. Actually, let's turn off the text to speech right here. Turn that off. Just hold to record. As you can see, it's all animated. It's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and stop that. And now we can go into our project files. And we got a bunch of options here. Let's see, let's trim. Let's trim one of these. Let's go ahead. You could actually select individual clips. Let's trim the poster. I feel like that was a little too long. Let's cut that shorter right there. And you can delete clips too. Let's delete this one right here. Delete that. And you can actually save clips individually. The original video clip isn't saved to your library. You can also mute. But interestingly, you can mute the recorded audio or the ambient audio. So you can mute the music. Now, some of the clips have speech. You can actually go in and change your live titles. So you can change the style. Let's choose this one right here. And even cooler, you can actually edit the text. So if there's issues here, you can go ahead and edit them. Make it perfect. And we can also add more effects. Add some extra effects. Let's see, what do we want to add here? Let's put Mickey in here. Place him somewhere right here. You can rotate him if you want. Close that. And here at the top, if you don't like that song, actually go and change it to something else. Or of course, you can just turn the song off. Let's go back, apply. So now that we've done some editing, we can go ahead and play it back. Then when you're all done, you can go ahead and hit share. You can do it through messages or mail, or if you want to do it to Facebook or Instagram, you can just save the video or save it to files. Then back at the top of the main screen is a project icon where we can create new projects just like that, or we can go and share them from here also. Now another cool feature is that videos are automatically uploaded to your iCloud, so you can go on your iPad to finish your videos. So Clips 2.0 is free to download, so go ahead and try it out and leave a comment below. If you enjoyed this video, like it and hit that subscribe button. Also, check out our price guide, which makes it extremely easy to find the best deals on Apple products updated daily. Be sure to follow us on social media, and we'll see you in the next video.